I'm sorry about that. I didn't hear anyone come in. What can I do for you? Well, I do believe the sign says the tattoos out front, so yeah, you're in the right place. Were you looking to get one or? Hmm. Okay. Well, lucky for you, it's been kind of a slow day. I could try to squeeze you in. What were you looking for exactly? Hmm. Have you ever had a tattoo before? <laughs> it doesn't hurt that bad. Hmm. I could think of some things that hurt more, but I can be gentle. Here. Hmm. That was just practicing. It's fake skin. Yeah, can tattoo on it. Here. I have a binder of like different artwork and stuff that I've done. You can take a little peek if you want some like inspiration. Yeah. I'll go ahead and set up for your tattoo. Oh yeah, it's all in here. I need to organize it better, but you can see there's like different designs and such. If you're into like animals. Stuff like this. There's some pretty designs, so I've done lots of stuff. It's all in here. Go ahead and take a peek, okay? Here. Yeah. Okay, so while you look at that, I'm gonna set up. I need to change out my needle and take your time, like I said. I'm in no rush. It's been kind of a slow day. <laughs> Let's see here. Well, so I can change the music and stuff too. If there's something specific you like to listen to. It's okay. Alright. Did you find something you like? What is it? Oh, yeah. I like that one. Actually, that one's pretty easy. I could probably do that one freehand. <laughs> no, I'm not bragging or anything, but maybe a little. Yeah. Well, typically we can use like trace paper and print it out and put like the image on your arm to like, you know, follow. But with that one right there. I could do it freehand, unless you don't want me to, of course. You trust me already. Smart. <laughs> Let me go ahead and open this and get it on the gun here. Tattoo gun. And you don't have like an allergy to like latex or anything bigger. Yeah. Yeah, they're a little big on me. I keep telling to try the shop owner to buy smaller gloves, but it's 
all I got for now. So, let's see her. Where do you want it? Yeah, you can get it anywhere. If I'm being honest, none of all the places I have tattooed uh, my rib cage. So unless you're a little bit of a masochist like myself, I would recommend not getting the rib cage. So, where do you want to put it? Okay. Yeah, that's pretty be like a good spot. It won't hurt as bad. Typically the spots with more like, you know, cushion. Yeah, those are better. Sure. Go ahead and hold out your arm there. And make yourself comfortable. The chair leans back and such. And we're just going to start by disinfecting and cleaning the area. And I'll probably have to shave it a little bit. Is that okay? Okay. So, go ahead and give me your arm. Go ahead and hold out your arm for me. Good, yeah. Now we're just gonna clean that out here. There's nothing to be afraid of. Now we're going to go ahead and shave off the area here. Yeah, we just don't want like hair or anything in the way. <laughs> Alright, so, let's hold it out right here and I'm just going to shave it. Good, let's see, it's not so bad. No, I've never had anyone shave your Now I do like to come through with a little bit of finer razor just to make sure, okay? You were worried about it uh, hurting, yeah. Like I said, I'll be gentle, but if you'd like, I do have some numbing cream I could put on it. It does take a few seconds to like set up and like do any effect, but we could put some of that on real quick and while I finish my like setup, it should take effect.
Brooklyn and show me the design again. Yeah. Okay, that looks really good. Yeah. So you want it right there on your arm. Mm, how big are we thinking? Yeah, you can show me with your fingers. Okay, yeah. And were you wanting it to be like colored in? Any like specific colors or do you want it to be just line work or shading? Okay. Yeah, I can do that. Um, let me just start with black here. Okay, here. Just put a couple of drops in here. Okay, here. Okay, and... This one's really pretty. Okay, I'll do a couple. Two, three, four. Okay. And let's do this one here. Like I said, if you want, I can go get like an like, outline to put on your arm to follow, but if you want to be a little daring, I'm pretty good freehanding. Yeah. Here. I can draw a little bit of an outline just to make you feel a little more comfortable. But since it's your first tattoo and you're trusting me, I can give you a little bit of a discount. Hold out your arm here little outline just so you can kind of see the size and placement tell me if you like it okay okay if you want to change it at all you let me know let's just trace that on here Like size and placement is it good? Yeah. Okay. Do you want to change anything? Make it bigger or smaller? Okay. Yeah. Well then, we should get started. Oh, like I said, it's not gonna hurt. Here, hold out your arm. <laughs> Did you feel it? See your. You can go ahead and, yeah, rest your arm on that armrest right there on that chair. I'd have you put it on the table, but it rocks a lot. And I don't want to mess anything up, so armrest it is okay. periodically to check on you. If it gets too much, just tap on me and let me know, okay? We also can take a break at any point, too. Alright, let me know if you have any questions. Let's do a quick line and see again. Ready? Three, two... See, how sad it wasn't so bad, was it? I told you. So, just try and relax. In through your nose, out through your mouth. And just breathe. You can listen to the music, your phone, headphones. 
that's whatever you want, okay? Alright, let's get started. Okay, stop. Alright, just check. Are you able to relax? Okay. I'm gonna keep going, alright? Let me know if you have any questions. Okay. Let's get some more ink first.
still working on the line work. Since I'm done with this one, I'm going to show you that. Okay. I'm almost done with the line work, don't worry. Yeah. And then we'll go ahead and move on. You're doing great, actually. Yeah. Already planning your next one. Alright. Let me know if you need anything. Yeah, go ahead and take a look. You like it so far? <laughs> Good. One second here. Just relax. I'm gonna grab a new needle. Yeah. Shading tip. It's a little bit different than the one that I've been using. The one I've been using has like one needle and it's for like line work and more precision stuff. Whereas like a shading needle has, you know, a few different needles. Like I'm using one with three. Wait right here while I grab the new tip, okay? There's like more needles and stuff. And when you're shading, you tend to go over the same spots a few times. So it's going to be a little bit more tender and hard, okay? All right, but we're almost done.
so it's not so bad, is it? Right. <laughs> Alright. We're getting there. Do you like it so far? Good. Yeah. I appreciate that. That's really sweet. See? That wasn't so bad, was it? Right. I say it's like an animal, like a cat or something, just clawing at the same spot over and over again. It's more annoying than anything else. <laughs> do you like it? Good, I'm glad. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean you up real quick. We're gonna put some cream on it and cover it with plastic wrap to keep it safe, okay? But first we have to set the ink. To set the ink, you have to smack it. Just hold it down and you got me. It's a joke we like to play. You have to start really bad. You don't have to set the ink. 
Well, just in case anyone ever tries to pull it on you somewhere else. You're welcome to keep coming back here. I'll do all your tattoos. No. Let me get all the left on here. Plastic. cream we're going to use to keep it healing properly. You do probably want to pick up some Aquaphor, okay? Yeah, you can get it at any, like, pharmacy, but Aquaphor, it'll be good to keep it on there, okay? And you may start to see it get, like, goopy and scabby. That's okay. Don't pick at it or anything, okay? Okay. I'll just do my hair. I'm just going to squeeze this on. Now you're not going to want to get it wet for a while. It takes about two to four weeks to heal where you don't have to like, you know, take care of it constantly, but it'll probably be like three to six months till it's like fully healed, okay? Okay. Any other questions for me? Yeah, you do have to pay, but I do take a bad mom. Yeah, you can just scan them right there. You can pay me there. Considering it's your first tattoo, let's just say, uh, pay me what you want. Hoping to make you a returning customer. You weren't so bad. Okay, you're not that bad to look at either. Alright, I'll see you soon.